uh, you know, we probably played, you know, for 32 minutes, great defense in my opinion. So we have to maintain and continue to get better with that. Um, they're one of those teams when we, in our scouting report. The biggest thing we talked about with those guys, because their coach, Rod, he does a great job with individual skill development. He has a reputation with that. And they're good one-on-one -on -one players. Um, and we talked in the scouting report. The biggest thing for us defensively, of course, you need your team defense, but we have to be good one-on-one -on -one defensively. And they made some plays one-on-one, -on -one, so we have to get better at that. But overall, I thought it was a great first game for our guys. I, I try to. I try to sit down, but it just, I just feel like I'm a part of the game with our guys. The same way in practice, uh, like a six man, so to speak, uh, giving them insight, talking to them. I just, I mean, I don't feel there's a need to sit down. Yeah, I mean, it's the way I'm in practice. I carry it over into the game. Um, I just feel like when I sit down, the game slows down. I, I, need, I need to give the guys the energy they need to push them through. And I think they get used to it in practice. But I thought it was a good game for our guys. Uh, I thought it was good energy in the arena. I thought they played hard. They had fun out there. And that's the biggest key. We play hard, play defense, rebound, play together, and try to have some fun in the midst of that. Now, you got a pretty extended look at your zone in the second half. Uh, how would you assess how that went? Our zone? Yeah. Not bad. Not bad. I thought they did a good job. I, I, what happens is uh, I thought our two guys up top did a lot of gambling instead of being solid. You know, have to be consistent up there. Do your job up top so they don't break down and penetrate the middles. You put a lot of pressure on our big guys. but. But overall, I thought they did a good job of slowing them down. Uh, so it, it was good for us. What did you think of Bird assists? I thought he did a good job. I thought, you know, and I haven't watched the film, obviously, but I thought he passed up four or five shots. You know, and, and I, I, the, the nine assists are great, but I thought he, he, he wasn't ready on a couple of shots to catch and shoot. But he ended up capitalizing on it with his dribble penetration and finding the right guys. Yes. Did a good job. I thought he did a good job. You know, dribble penetrating. I thought he had more assist than four. I thought he did a good job of putting pressure on the defense. I mean, that's his job. Get in the lane, make plays. Uh, you have that three-point opportunity. When it presents itself, get ready to knock it down. But I thought he did a great job putting pressure on the defense. Well, well that's, that's the goal. I mean, you have to be physically ready to do that. Our guys have to be able to run and push and make plays. Uh, but we try to do it in practice every day. Uh, we try to simulate a lot of different situations in practice, five on four, six on five, and just to really try to impose your will on both ends of the floor. And it's not easy. It, it takes time. Uh, we'll, there will be some bumps in the road. We'll take our lumps in there. But it's a process, and we've got to continue to get better. Uh, I, you know, we, we, we talk about it all the time. We talk about playing defense arm's length. So knowing what, when you're arm's length, there's not a lot of contact. And uh, in most cases with those fouls, we didn't do a very good job of being in arm's length. And uh, we paid for it. Oh, we weren't ready. We weren't in position before they got caught the ball. Um, and, and I thought, again, give those guys credit for putting pressure on our guys defensively and really driving the ball to force us to make plays defensively.